So we see more and more traction in the home automation markets. Whether it be connected home or small buildings, our everyday life is greatly facilitated by the creation of easy and accessible user-friendly interfaces. Home automation application enables us to manage large numbers of devices connected through a network based on Zigbee technology, which is today proven solution widely adopted. This amount of devices represent a widespread of potential uses like lighting, heating or presence control. With this network of 80 devices, we are showing how the STM32WB55 product is perfect to support such a complex configuration. And here I should highlight that it is a Zigbee certified platform. Its large memory can sustain wide network as well as allowing fleet management with over-the-air updates. Security mechanism proposed in the STM32WB prevents from cloning and are also protecting IPs. Dual core architecture of the STM32WB with a dedicated core to the radio activity is well adapted to manage real-time execution for both radio communication and user application with no compromise on user experience. Our smartphones or tablets, for example, are like a bridge to interact between connected home and human and are, for example, the first interface we can use to interact with a local network. This is the reason why both Zigbee and Bluetooth Low Energy have been combined to allow user interaction to pilot Zigbee network through a mobile phone. Our STM32WB embeds both technologies and the concurrent mode allows the router to discuss either Zigbee to the AT devices panel, either in BLE to the mobile. The mobile here is the entry port to configure the panel. The selected pattern configuration is sent to the router node through Bluetooth communication, can then switch to Zigbee technology to spread the pattern configuration to the AT device of the Zigbee network. So here I should highlight the cellular technology in this demo that connects the sensor dashboard to the cloud. Each device status of the network panel is known by the router. The router sends this pattern information to the cloud to replicate the information on a web user interface through the cellular modem. This is a Murata modem is based on ALT-1250 radio that supports both KTM and NB-IoT. It also features an embedded SIM from ST, the ST33G. The brain of the module is an STM32L4 ultra low power MCU. Being able to pilot locally the network with a mobile is one part of the demo interest. Then, going further in the framework, it might be also expected to screen the status of each device for somewhat remotely connected or for an autonomous cloud service. So I've shown you our demo. So how do we see this type of technology mix working in the Internet of Things? Well, many technologies are commonly used and combined simultaneously as shown in this demo. And such coexistence will increase with the IoT expansion. Final application usage must be kept simple to ensure end user adoption. This is why solutions must be proposed to leverage the complexity of managing all those technology as a whole. Many different industrial actors today are aware of this need and projects like CHIP, recently announced within the Zigbee Alliance, is addressing such paradigm and proposed to build a unified management for IP-oriented technologies. ST Microelectronic is supportive of the CHIP project and also proposed solutions with an enlarged parameters as we can see today through this Zigbee and BLE to cloud connectivity demonstration.